Constructed in 1951, ANZ National Stadium was originally known as Buckhurst Park after Rotary Club member William Buckhurst. The stadium was renovated twice, first in 1978, followed by a second renovation in 2012 to become the stadium it's known today. This game really could go either way. Both squads are packed with talent and experience. My co-commentator for this match is former All Black, Justin Marshall. Both teams really look up for this match, Justin. Interesting match up this. There's a bit of a buzz around the stadium as we wait for things to get going. It's hard to pick a winner leading into this. Both teams are pretty evenly matched. It's all... Waiting for the referee to get this one underway. And they try the long kickoff. Kickoff taken in. No stopping him there. And they've turned it over. It was good work by them leading up to that. Powerful defense. Number seven charges towards the try line. Now flat. The first five looking to score here. They fancy their chances here. Some old sevens under a bit of pressure. That's a forward pass there. Seven aside scores aren't much of a contest. Bind. Ball goes in, ball goes out. Need to work hard Set. to win the defensive scrum here. Costell looking for that quick ball. Ball's out here. Up and over the five metre line. Nano pulled down there. Costell, decent metres made on that charge. Mulder showing good pace and taken finally. Costell has the ball, sends it flat. Nano takes some stopping in that run. And he's knocked down hard. There's the ball. He's been hit hard. And they drive him backwards. Not releasing. And penalty. Well, that's pretty silly, really. I mean, it was only ever going to be a penalty. The first five brings it up to halfway. And he loses some ground there. Release. Crowd enjoyed that tackle. He spreads it. And he goes inside. Crunch to ground. That's a very flat pass. Inside with that pass. Hard and straight. Now flat. That's halfway. There's some real force in this defense. Nanai makes a good burst. On his way to the try line. And he's in. They did well. Great teamwork to build that try. What a try. They've played really well so far. Couldn't agree more. It was a beautifully timed run. And the gap, well, it just opened up. Shot at goal still to come. And chance for another two points. Not about to take this kick for granted. This one's drifting away, so the try remains unconverted. Yeah, he didn't hit it well, did he? So the kickoff is made. Kickoff dragged it. And he snatched in the tackle. Laluifi keeps the ball moving. Nanai gets to run a bit. Now they drag him down. Incredible! The hooker takes a run at the defensive line. And it's there now. Sends it flat. Spectacular! It'll be a try for sure. Laluipi gets the try. Well, that was simply outstanding work. Excellent build-up and a great finish. And they've scored again quickly here. They are red hot. Yep, I agree.
conversion is coming up. A real study of concentration here as he looks to convert the try from right out wide. The hooker with the kick looking to add points. Not what he was hoping for and he can't add the extra two. He looked down straight away so he knew it wasn't over. to secure this. Lalawipi nailed in that tackle. Costell pumps the legs with a good charge. Samoa Sevens looking to hold on to this. The front rower takes it out of the back. Costell gets inside the 22. I believe they've kept this for Samoa Sevens. Strong leg drive. Richards says, where are you going, son? Great tackle. Gets it past his 22-metre line. And he's got some support. Probing run towards the line. Yes, there's the try. They finally got him into some space and he showed us just how brilliant he can be. My word. Did really well there. Yes, indeed. It was a beautifully timed run, and the gap, well, it just opened up. Bang on, Justin. They've got their five, they could get their seven. The front rower sizing up this kick. Not what he was hoping for, and he can't add the extra two. Just not finding his rhythm with the boot. The restart. Nanai waits. Taken to ground now. He's broken the tackle of third. The number five brought down now. Powerful defense. Morgan moves it back. Lose his ground and momentum in that run. Nanai takes it. Shut down with a brutal tackle. Costell looks for options. The first five takes it in. He's got pretty good hands and he pulled off an excellent catch to prove it. The halfback crashing it up. The number three with a pickup. Great work to keep the ball alive here. The front rower has it out the back. Oh, that'll knock the wind out Not of him. Not releasing. And they'll take the penalty. Yeah, that was a silly mistake there, and they've conceded the penalty. Now flat. Inside pass. The number seven reels him in. The number four gets his man. There's some real force in this defense. Release. The number two finds support. The tackle's not enough. Carries it over the halfway line. The halfback stretching out. Surging towards the line now. Fantastic seven-a-side try. Just showed great pace there to score the try. He only needs a little space to work with. My word, that is a good try. A chance to add another two here. The number two looking to put them ahead with this conversion. Right, here's the kick. So it's a tight match, and the try remains unconverted. I think he just needs to settle himself down and get his timing right, Lisbo. Restart there. Kick off nicely taken in. The loose head prop makes some ground. And he shows the dummy. 
And number seven, looking to score here. He's over. This is what happens from constant pressure. They continue to probe the line, and they've come away with a great result. It was a beautifully timed run, and the gap, well, it just opened up. They've got their five, they could get their seven. This should turn into an easy seven points with the conversion. The conversion is wide. That's an easy kick miss there. A shocker, really. And it's a short kick. Caught and crashes it up. Smash! And the penalty is given. Yeah, that was a shockingly high tackle. Laloifi continues over halfway. Excellent run, but good defence made on him. Costell has it out the back. <laughs> Nanai has got a bit of room here, and off he goes. Costell feeds it off now. And he's solid under the high ball. It's so easy to drop the ball in a situation like that. But I've got to say, he never looked like dropping it. He hasn't made a lot of ground there, but he's got it into touch. Samoa Sevens, Fiji Sevens, they grab one against the throw. He's just gone into touch there. The Fijian Sevens lead at halftime, 15-10. Well, it's tight here at the break. Not surprising to see an even contest here between these two teams. Look at that so far. How do the stats stack up, Justin? As we look at the stats, we'll see some interesting details. They've persisted with this tactic of controlling territory. Lots of tries in the match already. The crowd are loving it. Not many turnovers so far. They've been able to keep the ball in hand. There are some good areas and some things to work on. Here we go with the second half. The hooker kicks off. The kickoff snapped up. Superb technique in that tackle. Nandai unable to hold it. Taken down in a strong tackle there. The ball is set up in the ruck. The tight end prop charges forward. The number one has the ball. Here comes the chase. Let's it bounce, but he's gathered it up. Powerful defense. The number five, plenty of pace. Probing run towards the line. He's over. Yes, an excellent try. They had to find a way through eventually. It just goes to show what supreme confidence can do. Exceptional skill. Superb try. It was a beautifully timed run, and the gap, well, it just opened up. No doubt about that, Justin. Conversion to follow. The front rower, with the kick now, lining it up. Not what he was hoping for, and he can't add the extra two. Yeah, he didn't hit it well, did he? Here's the kickoff. The scrum half takes in the kickoff. Big, big charge. Not a bad run, this. Number seven charges towards the try line. And he's thumped it down in the corner. Breaking through the line with amazing gas, and the finishing was superb. How good was that? The coaches will be pleased with that. Yep, that's right, Justin.
It was a beautifully timed run, and the gap, well, it just opened up. Shot at goal, still to come, and chance for another two points. Not the easiest of kicks here, but looking to convert this five-pointer into seven. The flags are up. And the score now, 27-10. What a wide angle to kick from. Really good finishing. Two kicks off for the short one. Costell to secure this. Now taken to the ground in a good tackle. The halfback takes it. The second five. Sounds a dummy. And it's a more. And they've got it at the back there. Probing forward now. The tight end prop keeps going. And that's a good burst. He's got no one left to beat. He'll surely score. And he gets it an easy conversion to come. That is what a finish is supposed to do. Outstanding try. Well, they've been absolutely outstanding, haven't they? Yes, you're absolutely right. We're all set for the conversion. This should turn into an easy seven points with the conversion. So, a simple kick from right in front. The number two easily converts the try. We have a route on our hands here, Nisbo. Now the kickoff. The number one snaps up the kicker. Not fast enough for the breakdown. Turnover ball. Costell gets the ball away. He's been hit hard and unable to fend off the tackler. The tight head prop makes the tackle. Costell gets it away. Ritchie goes off, running hard at them. Do they have this still? Yes, they do. Costell picks it up. Breaks the tackle and pushes on. That's a very flat pass. Larawifi thumped into the ground. There's some real force in this defence. The number two stops him with a nice tackle. Costell looks for options. Nanoy with a good run on his way to the try line and the try comes underneath the sticks. Well, they were never going to catch him and that's a brilliant try. Pure entertainment. What a great try. It was a beautifully timed run and the gap, well, it just opened up. Yep, totally agree. Conversion coming up, and you'd have to say two more easy points coming here for Samoa Sevens. So he lines it up right in front. No trouble with that. Two more points. Here's the kickoff. The tight head prop snaps up the kickoff. That pass was fired very flat. That's a very flat pass. Thrashing run into the line. Costell shows his pace. Surging towards the line now. Fantastic sevens try. Breaking through the line with amazing gas. And the finishing was superb. Simply magical, folks.
chance to add another two here should be a gift the hooker lines this one up no trouble with that two more points Kickoff is made. Kickoff dragged down. He hits it over there, 22. The ball is set up in the ruck. The halfback checks both sides. The number two races away. Surging towards the line now. That's two tries in the match now for him. That is a remarkable try. Talk about bringing a razzle-dazzle simply first class all the way. That is a superb try. We've got the kick still to come. Right, here's the kick. And it's wide, so the try remains unconverted. BG7's kickoff. The kickoff snapped up, taken down by the scrum half. Ball is ready now. He bustles his way forward. Pass goes inside there. Laroifi sprints away. Steps his way through nicely. That'll knock the wind out of him. Now flat. Over the halfway now. The 5'8". Oh, good run. He's nearly there. What a run. All the way to the chalk. He gets a double. Good try. They are looking good on the scoreboard now. Great pass. Got their five, they could get their seven. The number two will line this one up. Not what he was hoping for, and he can't add the extra two. He's just not timing it right at the moment. Go short. Kick off, take it in. Mulder tackles his man, stops him in his tracks. Good strong run. Postel loses some ground. Punches away with this run. Mulder keeps it going. And he's driven back in the tackle. Release. Yep, it's still on their side. Richards has copped a high one. And they'll take the penalty. Well, it looked high to me. And the ref agreed too. Huge carry this. Finally stopped. The front rower finds a teammate. He's over halfway. Boom. Running strong. Laloifi keeps the ball moving. Nandalai races Release. away. Coach won't be happy if it's turned over here. Turnover. Did well to create the turnover. Laloifi unable to stop him. That'll knock the wind out of him. Strong driving defence there. Do they have this still? Yes, they do. The number four gathers it out of the back. Runs it hard and fast at the defence. This is a move. The number seven controls it as they try for a few more yards. Support there. The number six 
shifts into overdrive. And he's well clear. Try coming up. Yes, he's on them. That's what they were looking for. A beautiful try, no doubt about it. Absolutely exceptional try. That's what they need to keep doing, really. Couldn't agree more. It was a beautifully timed run, and the gap, well, it just opened up. Dead right. And we're ready for the conversion attempt. The hooker will line this one up. Not what he was hoping for and he can't add the extra two he looked down straight away so he knew it wasn't over the restart Laloifi takes in the kickoff Natalie running hard Costell what were we seeing? Samoa Sevens giving away a penalty. You're right, Nisbo, and they won't be happy to have given it away like that. <laughs> and the game finishes. Fiji Sevens, the victors. Fiji Sevens with the win. A pretty interesting match, this one. They struggled to make any ground during this match. There were a small number of penalties conceded, which was good to see. Fiji Sevens come away the victors here. That's all we've got time for. See you next time.